Hey, I'm Johnny Scoville and this is Chase the Heat. So I'm, I've been on a quest for a long time to try to get in good shape and good health. And um, I've been talking to you guys a little bit about Pro Puffs. It's a product by Blazing Foods. And look, there's gonna be people that watch us that are in their 20s that you walk by a gym and look in the window and you get in shape a little bit. It's kind of how it works. But then you get to be my age and you walk by a restaurant, you look inside and you put on a pound. Everything changes when you get older. And if you wanna get in shape, protein becomes a very, very, very important component. It just does. Um, and high protein snacks are great for building muscle. And when you get to be my age, putting on muscle is a very challenging thing. It just is. You gotta take, it takes a lot more work. These are two products, two different flavor products, Pro Puffs, made by Blazing Foods. They're, it's a keto, uh, epic keto snack. In one serving, there's 25 grams of protein, 110 calories, and no sugar. If, 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 for people that know nutrition and are worried about their health, they're like, I'm sorry, what'd you say? Yeah, 25 grams of protein in one serving. This is apple pie, and it's amazing. I, I use this a lot in cereal. This is melon, uh, strawberry melon, strawberry watermelon. This is the one that I snack the most out of. I go through a lot of these just kind of snacking because they taste really good. I use this in cereal. <clears throat> now, a while ago I did a review for you. It was kind of a, just a kind of a short one, but it was about a, pro, a snack, a, a new flavor he was working on. All right. He's, Dave Foy from Blazing Foods is a perfectionist, like big time. I mean, when we, I, I've told the story before, but when we did the uh, Penango, it took like 13 or 14 versions before we settled on the one we went with. He just, he won't stop until he goes, okay, it's perfect now. <clears throat> I did the review of the Mocha uh, Espresso, okay? It's chocolate and coffee on these Pro Puffs. And when I reviewed them, they were good. I mean, I was they were great. I did them on the, and I got a big bag of them and I ate them on the plane, going to uh, see my daughter's graduation. It was really, it was great. Well, I got back. Um, and I had, there was a package when I got back and the package had a, a new, uh, the newest version of what D David made. Uh, and this, these are them. I'm going to just eat them and we're going to talk about these for a couple of reasons. But anyway, we eat, eat them first and I'll tell you kind of about them. Here they are. These are the Espre Mocha Espresso Pro Puffs. I'm Johnny Scoble, and this is Chase the Heat. If there's a little tray on your TV or your phone, and you can push a button, and it would slide one of these out, and you could eat it, 90% of the people that ate it would buy them. They are so good. It's more chocolatey. And you really taste the coffee. It's funny. We got on the phone. And when I ate them, I called him. And he goes, we talked about it. And he goes, I said, I said, they're amazing. He goes, I know, you're like me. He goes, I'm like you. I don't like looking for flavor. I don't like having to search for it. And I got to tell you, the, here's what's weird. It's just the strangest thing. They're just an amazing product. They're, they're 10 times better than any, than any cereal. The, the mocha, the chocolate, and the coffee. Listen, the, first, the ones I ate before I took off for that trip, I ate a bunch of these and did the video. If he hadn't changed them, would that have been fine? Yeah, probably. Are these better? It's just more chocolatey. I said, what'd you do? We're on the phone, we're talking. Like, what'd you do? He said, I just got the, I got it right. So. You hear the crunch? You've got people in your house and you're eating these. They need to eat them at the same time you are or you need to go to a different room. I'm not kidding. Back when I was living with Tom a couple times, I'm like, dude, stop it. He's like, no, go get a bowl. <laughs> you got to eat your own. You can't beat him, join him. 
<clears throat> the flavor of these are incredible. This is my favorite flavor by far, hands down, for a couple reasons. Number one, it's the greatest snacking as far as a snack. I mean, the before these came along, as far as a snacking, I kind of preferred the strawberry melon. But it's, it, in a cereal, nothing comes close to these. So these, this is my favorite flavor. In fact, I told much. You you'll give me one flavor. Just do one. You need more, I can see that. I'm gonna take the rest of this, throw them in this, throw some milk in, and this is gonna be the rest of my cereal, but. Everybody's worried about getting healthy. Everybody's worried, and, and I don't, you know, I don't own a scale. I don't even own one. So the only time I, like the what the, my, measuring stick so to speak is how my clothes fit it's not how i look in the mirror it's how my clothes fit if i'm wearing a shirt and I'm like boy this shirt's starting to feel baggy on me i got a problem if i got a pair of pants and the weight's getting tight i've got a problem so i just you know i feel better i'm not kidding and one of the coolest things that's really important i talk because the first couple times i did a review of these i don't think i talked about this aspect of the snack during the video I don't eat junk food. Like you won't ever see me sit down with a bag of Doritos and eat the whole bag. I review stuff, snacks and stuff. I'm just not that guy. That's not to say I haven't been that guy, right? I've been everything in my life. I've sat down and eat a family sized bag of Doritos and you can eat the whole bag. And you're like, just eat the munchies, just eat the power, just rah, rah, rah how it works with these if you if you are you're hungry and you're trying to you don't want to be eating the wrong foods if you eat a serving of these just kind of don't you need to put them in milk just kind of put it in your mouth and crunch them like i've been doing in this video something really interesting happens i don't think it's i don't I don't think I've ever experienced with a different food, okay? What'll happen is you'll eat a serving of this when you're hungry, like right now, it's morning time. I eat a serving of this, I'm done. Like it, it, you feel you have a full feeling, a sense that you're full. And to me, that's really weird with a snack. A snack doesn't ever do that. So snacks are just this ho empty, hollow, it just doesn't ever do it for you. With this, and, but, but I do want to share with this. This is, I'm just being honest here. That feeling like, wow, I'm full. Like I have a full feeling. I didn't notice that right away. It took a couple, it took maybe a couple days of, of munch on before I was like, hey, wait a minute. So it took a little bit. I, I was kind of like, you know, you run a diagnostics, you eat something, how do I feel? You start thinking about it. So you're aware instead of just kind of going through the motions on an autopilot. So I kind of was aware and I'm telling you, at, it's, I've never felt that with a different sort of snack where like a small serving, like have you ever had a single serve, the suggested serving of a snack and felt satisfied ever, ever? Go out and get a haagen a pint. Do you know what it says for suggested servings on a pint of haagen -Dazs? Four. Have you ever had four serving? Has anybody ever taken the thing of a pint of haagen -Dazs? Take the top off, eat some of it, put it back, and then three more times do that before it's empty? No. It doesn't work that way. So this is the only snack I've ever had where I took the suggested serving and was fine. It was like, that's very weird to me. So if you're, if you're, if you're, if you're doing it for, cause there's a lot of reasons to get this. If you're doing it for weight loss, it's the greatest snack in the world. It'll fill you up. There's no calories. It's protein. So there's a lot of reasons. If you're just doing it for taste, you're not going to find a better snack. It just tastes delicious. I mean, it'd be a great... You know what they should say? It's fattening as can be. There's so much fat in this. People, you know, I don't know. Is it is it because it's healthy? Is that the problem? It's amazing. So as far as just flavor, it's incredible. Like a cereal, it's incredible. But building muscle, afraid to lose weight, but building muscle is a big deal. I'm telling you, it's harder to build muscle when you get older. And there are people watching this that are that are my age. I'm sorry if you are, but. I'm building muscle. I'm in better shape now than I was the day that I graduated. 
I have more muscle mass. I promise you, I have abs. You know what I mean? I'm in better shape now than I was when I was 18. I'm 57. You can get like that. And this, I'm telling you, this helps. It wasn't a one, it wasn't a single thing. It wasn't like, ah, oh, it was just the biking or it was just the inclined bench or whatever, all the stuff I was doing. It was ES Power Drink. That helped. It's Pro Puffs and it's I Care. But I'm in the best shape of my life. You can do that too. So in the description box, if you want the healthiest snack, it's really going to change your life. I'm not, it really will. The link's in the description box. Please buy this. You'll be happy you did. Honestly, it's a game changer. But of all of them, this is like the apple pie tastes good. The strawberry melon tastes good. This tastes like a junk food snack. This does not taste like a healthy snack at all. It's chocolate and coffee. Get them. You'll be happy you did. Right there is my son, Johnny Scoville Jr. Right there is the lifeboat. Please check it out. Right there are all of the challenges I've done since this bizarre journey began. And right there is pepperology if you're brand new to the pepper game. I love you guys. I mean it. I'm Johnny Scoville and this was Chase the Heat.